Hey guys, what is going on? My name is Sir Godwin, and first I'd like to apologize about the little black ring going around on the edge. If it does show on the video, I don't know for sure if I'm going to be able to edit that out. Um, but I do apologize for that, it is there. And secondly, here we go. I'm going to show you guys how to install, um, how to set up a follower alert for your Twitch streaming using XSplit. Um, that's what I use. Uh, OBS is really simple. Um, I'll, I'll, I'm also going to make a video on how to do that. Um, firstly, there is an install video that shows that this is my way of showing you. First thing you're going to do is you're going to type in your uh, your uh, your username, mine is Sir Godwin. You're going to choose which style. You can either go to stack style or it's going to load preview or you can go to flat style. There's also the old um, custom ones. I don't know how to do those, but yeah. Um, you can then, uh, this is what you're going to do, you're going to choose your alert color, what color you want it to be. Um, I'm not going to do too much. You can also take an audio file, which you will have to take a 10, um, a 10 second clip, I believe it is. And you, yeah, 10 second uh, te uh, alerts last for 10 seconds. So make a 10 second clip, get it in OGG format. I will put a link in the description on where you can do that. Um, I'm not going to do too much about this because I already have one set up and I don't want to ruin it and have to redo all the stuff. Um, it's going to create a, uh, a hosting URL. You can go, um, you will need to copy this right away. So actually, actually, I'm just going to have to, I'm just going to screw it. I'm just going to make a whole new one. Usually I'll go with the green this way with the green, with the chroma key effect. It actually makes it so it's just the black and white. I think it looks pretty cool. I'm going to go next. Oops, my bad. Let me set up my file. Let's go down here. I use the shatter me open. Next, you will get this link right here. What you're going to do is you're going to, as soon as it generates, you're going to copy this link. Go copy right there. You can see down here it says at preview true. I'll tell you tell you about that later. There you go. That's it. That, you're, you're done. You're done with setting that up. Now what you're going to do is you're going to open a whole new page. You're going to go paste and go. Now it will show a green a green thing. Yep, there you go. All right. Now if you're going to to, to show that it is working, you're going to go at the end. Go that thing. I don't know what that thing is called. Um, preview. I spell. Okay. Yeah, I'm still in preview. Right. Okay. Equals true. Now I'm going to turn down my. my uh, my thingy real quick because it is pretty loud um you'll click enter you can you can kind of hear it i guess but you can see it says new follower test user there you go now you know that is working now i'm going to go on to here we're going to separate this you're going to need this to be open during your stream uh, let me just continue to exploit real quickly right here i'm actually using obs to record this so i don't have to do with it deal with it okay so what we have here is I'm just going to take my Christmas theme scene right here. You can see there is me right there. All right, so what we're going to do, I already have one set up, but we're going to set up another one just because. Let us go and we're going to add screen capture. And you're going to take this and you're going to go like this. Left click over here and drag it around to right there. That's about where the... Uh, where it actually shows up so here you go you can see a little green screen effect and you go and you still have the at equals true or whatever I put in before uh, at preview equals true and you can see there it is now I, you can tell this is an annoying green looking thing you don't want to have this showing up on your stream so what you're going to do you're going to click on that you're going to go to the settings you would then go over to color chroma key mine immediately sets it but make sure this key color is green anti anti-alias -al I don't know how to pronounce that word it's that thing right there make sure that's on high and there you go it has disappeared so we're gonna show you again it does work there you go now you can resize it and do whatever you want with it move it wherever you want with it I'm gonna remove it though because I don't need it I already have one set up but there you have it that's really all you need to do to set one up for exploit if you um Blah, blah, blah. If you ha if you have OB if you want to know how to do it for OBS, I will have a link in the description on how to do it for OBS. Anyways, my name is Rich Robin. I will see you guys in the next video.